Hello, today I got my package, my picks have come, which I ordered off Amazon, but for some reason it wasn't an Amazon package, but nothing else it could be because it's addressed to me. So I'll just open them this way probably. Whoa, what's weird. Uh, this is not the packaging I was expecting. That's the packaging. This bag is made from a minimum 30% post-consumer waste plastic and can be recycled again if disposed of correctly. Interesting. To avoid danger or suffocation, keep this wrapper away from babies and children. I am recyclable. So, a bit of paper dropped on the floor. Oh, that's just uh, the thing that's supposed to stick on the actual package, I think. Uh, variety, uh, Jim Dunlop, a variety, medium, light guitar, pick, player, pack. Yeah. So that's what I ordered. A uh, Jim Dunlop variety pack. It has um, different sizes. I think it has two different sizes, but multiple versions of them. So let's just see. Opening, opening, opening. Oh, these are those weird, uh, weird packages. There we are. Now this is what I saw on Amazon. I guess it's smaller than it looks in the preview online, but... Variety pack. D -d -d this one here is the type that I already have somewhere. Uh, multiple. Those are the ones I had from years ago, this orange type. Uh, but I left it somewhere else. And I don't know why I didn't store them all in my guitar case, because that's where I used to store them. And it makes sense to store them in there, but they weren't in there for some reason. So this is the light medium pack, 12 pack. On the back it tells you, um, Tortex, Tortex, Gator Grip, Gator Grip, Prime Grip, Nylon, Nylon. What does, what's that? Um, celluloid, a Max Grip. But these are actually, I think, 0.6 millimeters and 0.73 millimeters. I think it's only those two. Unless I'm mistaken, but I think that's what it was that I ordered. And, you know, I'm, I'm following this course, kind of. I'm kind of picking and choosing at the moment, but <laughs> JustinGuitar.com and he suggests using a really thin pick, like the thinnest picks you can find. Like a 0. Point, what was it, 0.38, I think it was. But the problem with that is, um... They only sell them in packs of 12 on Amazon, so, and I didn't want to spend like £7, whatever it was, on on a pick which uh, I've seen other people, you know, kind of complain about with gu electric guitar. I, ha I have an electric guitar, so, and I, and I, from reading online, those really thin picks are useful for, more for the acoustic guitar and not so much for the electric, so, and I, I thought I'd, get a variety pack instead. It would have been nice if the variety packs had one of those super thin picks but for some reason none of the variety packs have the super thin picks uh, um, with them which is really weird since it's meant to be like a variety of different sizes and they don't include that. The only one I saw was the 12 pack on Amazon so I just decided to stick with the size that I had been using previously years and years and years and years ago and uh, hopefully you'll be okay. Let's, whoa, 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 whoa. Let's open this. Okay. Well, how do I get in here? I think I just ripped this apart. Guess so. Here we have it. 
This is the one I'm familiar with. 0.6 millimeter Dunlop. Uh, I think that's just the. I don't know what that one's made out of, to be honest. Tortex, I guess. Then we have this yellow one. 0.73 millimeters. And. Whoa! Nylon! So, this is also 0.73. So they're all either 0.73 or 0.6. Whoa! And this one's called Max Grip. Is that the same as this? I don't think so. Um, oh, this is a light one. What's this called? Dunlop USA. Point six nylon that goes here, I guess. Another max grip point six. And what goes it? This is a Dunlop Otex. I don't know where's the other Otex here, but what's this one called? Celluloid, maybe. Not sure. Thin, medium. I'm kind of confused why I have... Oh, here! Here it is, up here. I was going to say why there's an odd number. That one... And... But these do not seem like they match, to be honest. What's this one called? Prime Grip. This one's called the Prime Grip. Um, I'm kind of confused because this one's a Prime Grip and this one's an Ultex. So these two are not really matching like the rest of them are. But that's interesting. I'm probably not even going to end up using all of these unless the I lose the other ones. I'm probably just going to start with this one because that's the one that I was familiar with. But, yeah, I'm g glad to have some backups just in case. I've no idea really, you know, what difference the material makes. Since, you know, whether it's Tortex or Otex. Yeah, so, look. Um, in the picture, you're supposed to have two Otex. Here, I've only got one Otex and this weird prime grip. Um, these are in the picture, these two are in the picture, these two are in the picture, um, the nylons are in the picture, these two grippy ones are in the picture. So, it's just these two, well this one is in the picture, but this one is not. This, this is a prime grip, I don't think that's supposed to be here, it's supposed to be another one of this, uh, Altex. But again, not. I don't know the difference anyway. Maybe the prime grip is better. Uh, it says 71 on the front of it. I don't know if that means it's 0 0.71 millimeters. Um, but yeah, it says it just says prime grip and 71. That's a bit odd. So the Shred Player Multi Pack has two Delrin 500s, but these are. 1.5 and 2.0 millimeters. This base picks um, player pack has a Delrin, but it's a 96. So I guess that means 0 0.96 millimeters. So I, I've no idea where this came from because this is a 71. It says on it, and that's not in any of the packs that I've I've just checked on Amazon. So that's really bizarre how it turned up in here. But I've no idea if that's good or bad because the the one that's supposed to be here is the Dunlop Otex 0.73 because all of these are either 7.73 or 0.6. So we got the 0.6 but not the 0.73.
That's kind of bizarre. That makes me want to use this, actually, because it's the odd one out. So, you know, I don't know. Well, the customer reviews of this um, one specific pick that I searched out, um, pretty good. Customers like the grip quality, comfort, durability and flexibility of the Plectrum. For example, they mentioned that the double-sided grip circle works well, stays firmly in the fingers and does not wear out easily. Some are also satisfied with the sound, thickness and ease of use. AI generated from the text of customer reviews. So, you know, I'm probably going to stick with the, um, the thinner one when I'm starting out because I am a beginner and uh, I should probably get to use with it momentarily. Bye!